her to the frickin' ray. I'm back with another Crossing Digital Info Review video by Jordan and them with the Florida Street Crossing right here in front of Gorda, Florida. Today's date is Monday, October 14th, 24. And uh, I'm back. I'm, I don't know. I don't know. You tell me. I, I don't got a script. I'm sorry. Okay, look, I'm sorry for talking like this. I, I just kind of didn't want to do this digitally because I'm more into doing it physical now because it's just much better to get out and you get to see much more info better. But sad news is... The cross, these crossings right here are not there anymore. Well, except they're signals and the mechanical ball on the east side. But they just got a different mast. That's what it is. That's why it looks a little more brighter and thick. Don't judge. It's not sussy or anything. I'm just, I'm just describing it because you know how the mast used to look in those days? Yeah, it's a little thin. So get me clear. And they never really used to have any emergency information back then. Until around... 2015, yeah, that's the year. So, anyways, without so much garbage out of my freaking sight, let's get going with the basics. Yay! Oh my gosh, I really want to go out. But despite so much school and all that stuff, I okay, let's just let's just let's just go on. So, starting off with this eastern gate mast with no gate mechanism nor it nor gate arm, we have. A pair of front lights on the mast facing south. Incandescent modern industries or western colonnade signals. 12 inch lights and 20 inch plates. And that's where we slide to the northern side. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm correct. Another incandescent signals, modern industries or western colonnades. 12 inch lights and 20 inch plates. Yep, same inch as the one facing front. Yeah. The front pair right here. Yeah. The one I, the one I'm circling, yeah, that's the one. That's the front pairs. The back one is is the one facing north. So now you get the point. The back ones on the left, on your on, on your left side, yeah, those are considered the back, and the ones on the right facing us as well is known as the front. Now you get the point. All right. Oh yeah, don't forget the mechanical bell. Oh, this is much better. This is May 2004. This is May 2014 timeline. The previous one was June 2011. To make it more clear. Now we're in 2014. Still the classic days, I tell you. Classic days. So anyways, getting on with it. This is a USNS mechanic ball. How I can tell it is? Well, as you can see, the left side doesn't have anything, but the right side it has something. So, that tells me it's a USNS. And I can prove it because it because recently in the in the newer days, this gate mask ha, has a new map. It has the same pair of signals and a mechanical ball too. I don't know about the crossbow. I don't know if it's the, it's actually the same one as the same nose. Like, like 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 for instance this one. Yeah. So yeah, this one is the same mechanical ball as the previous one. See like well, yeah, there. So yep, and you can see nice and clear. You can see two S's combined with each other and a U. I think I don't know. It looks like an I or something. It would stand for like ISS or something, like getting detention basically. You get the point. But yeah, this is a USNS mechanical bell. And I'm quite surprised they never replaced it with an E bell, nor the LED, nor uh, the incandescent with LEDs like they did with this. Just suck, son of a. So anywho, now you get the pro now you get the topic, the concept. Uh -huh. I feel like I'm losing track, dude. I'm sorry. But anyways, moving on. Another, 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 another. Did I take so much chocolate milk today? Because, no, I did not. I don't even drink chocolate milk too much. So, these are another Mono Industries. Or Western Colony saying those 12 inch plates, 20 inch plates. And the front lights of the Western. Gateless Crossing it has another modern industries or Western colonies and contestants saying those 12 inch lights and 20 inch plates. And might be a Western colonies. I don't know. Western colonies mechanical ball. Let's see if. Oh no. None of the qualities are good. Okay, so apparently, yeah, that. Yeah, they're mechanical. I, I, I suppose it's a Western colonies. It has got to be. I'm pretty sure for sure it is. Well, I, I mean, I don't exactly know if it's a federal signals. I don't know. But I I think I think the common purpose for this might be a Western Colonnade. So, 
But sadly, I'll never get to film at this crossing because it's not there anymore. I'm sorry I have to say the word, but I have to. It's one way for me to give my message to Ian. Yes. That son of a... You know what? Scratch it. I'm not going to say it. I just already said I just already said the actual word. I already said the other word to him. Yeah, Ian really is. Hurricane Ian is, along with Milton, Hellion, Irma, and even Charlie and Nate and Dorian. Yeah. yeah those idiots. All hurricanes. Not even not even one hurricane that I like. There's nothing I love about these hurricanes. They suck. They really do. I mean the only thing I do like them is that they give us no school. But they give us so much damage. I mean I mean that's the reason why I hate hurricanes so much. And that they ruin my childhood crossings. Well, it's gotta be like this forever now. So, well, unless it unless many more years pass by and this gets older, so I, I don't know. I got no words. But yeah. Anyways, that's the classic info for this classic crossing, Florida Street. Rest in peace to classic crossings, except the St. Louis and the mechanical. Well, probably the cross, but but the entire but the entire set on the west. Rest in peace. Especially your mask, too. Eastern side of Florida Street. <laughs> this video sucks. I'm ending this. I hope you really enjoyed, actually, if, if you did like it. But for those that didn't like it, I really understand your pain. Really understand your opinion, more likely. Yeah, that's the word. Anyways, this is Jordan. I'm signing out. Goodbye, y'all. And have a good life.